Hey everybody, this is Pastor Shane Pooler with your Monday morning moment. Just want to take a few minutes uh, of your time here this morning uh, to first of all say how grieved we are and how heartbroken we are over what took place in Sutherland Springs, Texas yesterday. Um, we were just, we were dumbfounded, we were shocked by it. And we are certainly here at Highway Tabernacle had special prayer last night for them. And we'll continue to pray for all of the families, the pastor, uh, and, and all of those that have been involved in this terrible tragedy. On another note, um, I wanted to take just a few moments here and share with you a, a quick thought to hopefully help encourage you uh, this week as you move forward. Uh, in your daily life. Yesterday I preached on the message about the prodigal son. And that's a very familiar verse of scripture and very familiar story. And I shared with um, the congregation last night as we were concluding the message how that prodigal son, when he returned, um, he came back to his home, uh, how he was received. You know, sometimes people hesitate coming back to the church after falling or after failing um, because they're not sure how they're gonna be received by the local church, by the people um, who once trusted them, who once depended on them. I can tell you that that's not an easy task. It's something that is very, very difficult to do it's more difficult because of our pride and it's more difficult because of uh, our perception uh, or how we think people perceive us. But I can tell you, just as uh, the prodigal's father was watching and looking for him, remember the Bible says that while he was yet a far way off, the father saw him and ran to embrace him. I want you to know that Jesus is doing the same thing. He's looking for you. He's watching for you. He's waiting for you and longing for you to come back. I also want you to know that as you, as you come back and when you come back, that you are not going to be judged and you are not gonna be chastised because of past failures. That's not the way Jesus works. Jesus is thrilled and excited in the fact that you have come home. I know it's gonna be a tough thing to do. I know that it, man, it seems like an obstacle that is beyond uh, our comprehension. But I can tell you that those people that you think are going to judge you and those people that you think are gonna hold you in contempt, you'll be shocked at how quickly they run to embrace you to place the best robe on you, to help put you back in that position of authority again, and to help establish through the sandals uh, the freedom uh, that has been given to you. You see, during those times, um, only slaves went barefoot. And so when the father gave the prodigal a uh, new pair of sandals, it was to reestablish the fact that he was no longer a slave but he was free. I'm here to tell you today, folks, that there is a way back. It may seem like a hard way back, but if you have fallen, if you've gotten away from the Lord, he is looking for you. He is longing for you. And there are many that are anxiously awaiting your return. And when you return, we are going to celebrate your new life and we're gonna celebrate all that Christ has done in you. So this week, I want you to know there are those who are praying for you, those who love you. If you'll just simply turn around and come back to him, he will take all of those scars and all those bruises and all those things and make them seem as if they never happened. So until we speak again, I want you to know that we're praying for you and that we love you. This is Pastor Shane Pooler. Highway Tabernacle Church of God in Kennewick, Washington with your Monday morning moment. May the Lord richly bless you.